Oh my gosh, super massive! Super massive! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! This is fire! Ah! TV still cut off, nigga still bald. Somebody's behind him though. What did I say like that for? Somebody's behind him though. Somebody is right. What? What? Good job. Sony Interactive Entertainment presents. Welcome back. Hey. Let's get into this. Finn took Becky to the house where Adam Jones was raised. Becky disturbed a hidden camera at the crime scene, and the camera contained secret footage of Calvary's murder. Becky talked Vernon down after he pulled a gun on her, and Vernon revealed his brother's links to corrupt cops. The Undertaker's widow said his husband regularly used prostitutes, and the orderly used prostitutes too. Becky decided to check this with Simon Hillary. Like he had a good look at the figure following her. No ass. Wait, I thought that was Becky. Becky aided Finn's escape so he could find Adam. Pause on that last comment. Finn told Becky that his hostage was working with him during his arrest. Wow. Finn, you look like a real sus boy right there, my boy. I'm gonna need you to fix your mouth, close your eyes, get on my and face. Now Part three of Hidden Agenda. It's a wild game. Super massives. Super massive games. I think it, yeah, super massive games. I'm gonna need you to stop putting the plot in my phone before it happens on the game. That's ridiculous. Temple Bar, Bar and Grill, six hours since Finn's escape. Remember, Becky set him free to help lure Adam Jones back to us. Here we go. Pause on this game real quick. Ripple, ripple effect. I'm not even gonna show y'all what I just saw on my phone. I'm not gonna do that to y'all. The guy on that video, in the hoodie, same guy I chased earlier. You sure? Pretty sure. All right, so this hooker, she's working with the trapper. Why? She lures them and kills them and he sets up the trap? She got a hoodie on too. <laughs> Felicity has a hoodie on too, Becky. How are you not asking her? You're gonna let your partner pre Okay, see, Becky. So where did the hooker go, thoughtful? Yeah, ask questions. I need you to start. Uh, the thing that I'm stuck on, where did the hooker go? She goes into the bathroom and the hoodie guy comes out. Thanks. You don't recognize that hoodie at all. When Calvary was investigating the trapper five years ago, he had one big blind spot. Prostitutes. The first target, the Undertaker. Met with a hooker the night he was killed. The second target, the orderly. Arranged a meeting with a girl, an escort, the night he was killed. And now Calvary is killed by a hooker. At least someone dressed like one. Maybe the trapper is using a hooker to lure his targets to a premeditated murder site. I just, I don't even know what to think anymore. I feel like everyone is out to get me. Don't worry, detective. You're safe with me. You got me effed up, Felicity. My, I'm not, uh, that's the thing with these kind of games. I can't tell y'all what I think is gonna happen because it might take away the experience, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Felicity is both. She's playing both right now. She's playing the killer and She's playing a lot of roles, but it's it's Felicity. I'm 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 almost positive it's her. And she showed up to this dinner in the in the in a hoodie. Come on, relax. I'll cheers to that paranoia. What did she say? You're safe with me. Nah. <laughs> no one's ever safe in this town. Maybe Finn's right, and Adam Jones is the one behind all this. But if he really is the one doing all this, where is he now? You know what? It's pretty late. Mm, I'm sure it is. Yeah. My advice, sleep on it. Take all this to Sergeant in the morning. All right, 
See ya. Hello? I found Adam Jones. Finn? Where are you? I'm outside his house. I told you I'd find him. I'm outside his house right now. Wait, where? In town? Yeah. Uh, have you talked to him? I followed him home. He didn't see me. Some woman left his place a little while ago. Now he's just in there by himself. What's the address? 1712 Alameda Road. Of course it is. What? I'm on my way. Don't go anywhere. What is that address? What is that address? And where the heck did Felicity just run off to? I bet she sliced her tires on some weird psycho... Oh my gosh, my headphones are so loud right now. My little foot just shaking. Who's in the... Oh my gosh. Who the hell is that? Oh, 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 she oh, got me! She got me, y'all! Oh, okay. oh my okay. gosh! What did I just do? Hey, Lana. What do you mean? Keep your email now. What email? Oh. Whoever did this makes a compelling argument Marnie killed Calvary. Well, more than just Calvary. Play the audio. Becky Marnie, y'all. The white girl. I, I just... not believe the mouth on this Marnie chick. We gotta be careful or she'll blow this whole operation. What'd she say? Threatened me. Us. All of us. She's out of control. Is that my partner? I've been holding on to that for years. Oh, never mind. Did you recognize the voices? No. Should I? It's been confirmed. There are two of the officers killed by the trapper. Look, Marnie's been weird, and yeah, she had motive. And? She didn't have opportunity. How do you know? She was with me the night that Calvary died. Ah. Uh, I mean, if she didn't, it'd be one hell of a trick. Hmm. Hmm, I forgot about that piece. I forgot about that piece. Somebody had died. Oh, Calvary died. No, no, Calvary. These names, bruh. That dick cop died. Dick cop. Pause on that. When I was with Felicity. And she and and he had died on camera. So it couldn't you know, be Felicity. I want to track down Daniela. Mmm. Daniela Cardones. You're in a lot of trouble, young lady. Suck my nuts. <laughs> Finn's come clean. We know you weren't a real hostage back in 2012. Look, I get it. You and your sister went through hell. The cops did nothing. They failed you. And you wanted to make them pay. Cough up. Adam Jones, right? He offered you a way to get back at them all. I don't know what you're talking about. Yes, you do, and it's a felony. But help us out. Maybe we'll let bygones be bygones. Hmm. Sure. He's the one who set it up. He told me what he did to the fuckers who hurt me and Izzy, but I have no clue where he is now. You haven't seen him at all since the arrest. I saw him once. He didn't recognize me. He looked all different, but I recognized him. You can always tell from his creep-ass eyes. <laughs> Even all cleaned up. You're one to talk. You cleaned up how? I don't know. He's like a cop doctor or something. Detective Carter, I need to speak with you. We're right in the middle of something here. Now. Don't go anywhere. Oh. My. There's been an abduction. Judge Van Stone. That, that's what they told me. That's what they it told says me. It was Becky Marnie who took him. It didn't say that, though. Did y'all hear her say he's 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 like a cop? She First of all, she's want to talk about eyes. She looked like a damn raccoon, okay? Full of garbage and smoke around her eyes. But she said Adam Jones looks like a cop doctor now. Somebody having sex in the next room? 
Yeah. Oh, 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 I'm in, I'm in her house. I'm in the girl house who got me. Oh, Becky, we need sweet revenge. We need sweet revenge. We need sweet revenge. What the fuck? Oh, God. <gasps> Judge Van Stone? Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. Oh, God. <sighs> What, what, what did she do to me? What did she put inside of me, goddammit? Ah, uh, Judge uh, Van Stone, I, um... What is it? It's the trapper. You're... You're, 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 you're rigged! I, uh... What? Oh, no. No, 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 no! It's probably in an, an, an explosive and shit. Gotta pull this out. Oh god! Oh my gosh! How's your head, Detective Marty? I'm coming for you. They know you did it. They know you killed everyone. There's no escape. You're the trapper, Becky. Who are you? Why are you doing this? Simon. Simon? I know it's you, Simon. Adam? I fucking know. Impressive work. I'm almost sorry no one's gonna get to know how good of a detective you are. If Simon is who I think it is, I knew I felt that way for a reason last time, but yep, Simon Hillary. Simon Hillary was almost killed by a trap break to Jack Calvary's body, and it's him. It's him. If you will notice, there is a small heartbeat tracker on Judge Vanstone's wrist. He's Adam Jones. It is synchronized to a cell phone that I have surgically implanted into his stomach. The phone is just a timer, but every beat of his heart knocks another second off. The faster his heart races, the quicker the clock. Now, would you care to guess what happens when the numbers reach zero? Kablam! Kablam! For anyone in, say, uh, a hundred foot radius, give or take. Which will most likely include all the police who are swarming in to arrest you right now. Sometimes killing is the only option. What? You can try to run, but I can't promise you I'm not gonna pop that balloon a bit early. And there's enough explosives in there to level the whole floor. Jesus Christ. I left your fire on for a reason. Stop his heart. Stop the timer. You can't be serious. I can be whatever I want. You can be alive or you can be dead. That's your choice. And the clock's ticking. Judge Vanstone, first of all, calm down. Don't talk so to what me. What did he say? Are you gonna get me out of this? That wasn't on speaker. You can flee or you can stay. I'm pausing on that. You can flee or you can stay. Oh, wow. That one split action command. They already think that I'm the trapper, right? So if I leave and all these cops die, I'm gonna die right now or later. You know what I'm saying? But if somehow I can keep Judge Vanstone alive and stop this bomb, he will know that it wasn't me. He's my only, uh, like, he's my only defense right now. I got, I gotta stay and get him out of here. This is crazy. You gotta stay, Becky. I'm sorry. What did he say? Could you get me out of this? First please? of all, stop yelling at me. I'm trying to help you. Think, Becky. Think, Becky. I'm right here with you. Oh wow. Oh wow. This isn't what I thought. I'm really sorry.
be frustrated that's gonna make it worse why in god's Shh. name please 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 just stay stay calm stay calm I, 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 I. Oh, shit. if the timer reaches zero then we're both dead how much time don't even tell him don't tell him the time yeah you got to right now we have plenty of time okay so then that way. Let's just stay calm and then we can figure this out. So, if you take this phone out of me, it can't hurt me, right? You gotta get it out of me! You gotta get it out of me? What? Okay! Ah! <laughs> oh, no! Please! Ah! I can't take it! I'm ready. I'm ready. Oh, I'm, on, ready. Come on, come on, come on. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm yeah. ready. No way. Yes. No way. You stopped it. You stopped it. Did he just die? Did he just die? No, he's still breathing. He's still breathing. He's still breathing. Oh my gosh! You have five missed calls. Contacts. Fuck Felicity! Fuck Felicity! Carl Carter. Becky, God damn it, where are you? Oh my God, Carl. We got a tip you kidnapped Judge Vanstone, said you were at the Elliott Hotel. We got it surrounded. I'm at the hotel, but you gotta help me. Please. Ah. Uh, damn it, Becky. You we got two minutes, then SWAT's coming in. That's all. Carl. Thank you. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Super massive! Super massive! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! This is fire! Ah! Hold up! Jesus. You're cutting it close there, Carl. I'm not gonna check none of that, because it, it gives too much away. I'm gonna just play. Oh my gosh, did I really make it out of there? Let's go! Let's go! That scene, that scene might have been... Bro, that was one of the wildest decision-based scenes I've ever played in my life. And the fact that all that happened because I missed a, I missed, I missed, I missed a simple action command. She went like this from the back seat. I'm like, dude, can I get a second to? Well, I mean, that was that was her goal. She achieved it. She got me. Who need it? Who did it? She got it. He's here. Adam's inside. Come on, let's go get him. We gotta do this now. No. No, I'm going alone. 
You don't know what he's capable of. I said get out of here. I didn't say that. I did not tell you to say that. Oh my gosh, we going in here alone? There go Hillary. That's Hillary. Wow, Hillary's really Adam Jones. I thought it was Felicity this whole time. Good move. Freeze. Don't move. Don't move. Huh. You got me. I've had enough of your shit. Whoa! Oh, it's gonna be like this? Oh, I said it! I didn't mean to shoot him! I didn't mean to shoot him! I panicked! I panicked! I panicked! I'm gonna let it rock, though. This is fire. This is what Supermassive wanted. They wanted us to panic, and they got me. Becky told Felicity about her feud with Calvary. Later, Felicity met with her at the bar to discuss the case. Becky didn't provide an alibi for the night of Calvary's murder. Even so, her partner agreed to call off the SWAT teams. He'd gain her trust during the day. Becky aided Finn's escape so he could find Adam. Finn tracked Adam to his new address. Finn told Becky that his hostage was working with him during his arrest. The police questioned her and learned that Adam had become a police doctor. Earlier today, Judge William Vanstone was kidnapped from his home on the east side of the city. He has since been rescued and is back with his family recovering. Detective Marty escaped the scene and then proceeded to invade the home of Simon Hillary, a forensics medical examiner with the local police. Detective Becky Marney has been investigating Hillary in connection to the murder of Detective Jack Calvary. Simon Hillary, a forensics medical examiner with the local police department, was being considered a suspect and has now been shot and killed by law enforcement at his residence in the South Bank neighborhood. According to files we've obtained from an anonymous leak within the police force, Detective Marnie was implicated in the notorious 2012 Trapper killings, previously attributed to Jonathan Finn. We've heard an unconfirmed report that Detective Becky Marnie may have aided in the escape of convicted serial killer Jonathan Finn. Jonathan Finn has been taken into custody and is reportedly cooperating with the investigation. Sources say he may have played a key role in identifying Hillary as a suspect. An investigation is ongoing. Sergeant Riggs made a brief statement to the press only moments ago. If this game ends right here, I'm disappointed. I'm not disappointed. I'm not disappointed, but I'll talk about it after this. If, if this game ends, they don't even let me hear the press. All of us on the force are very grateful to Detective Marnie. Thanks to her tireless efforts, the Trapper's killing spree is finally We trusted Simon, and we never considered. He slipped right by us. Well, not all of us. Not my partner. Becky Morney saved my life. She should get a goddamn medal as far as I'm concerned. I already told you everything I know. Why don't you leave me alone? I didn't want any of this to happen. None of it's gonna bring my sister back. Do you understand? Man, shut up, Sly, Sly Cooper. Yes, she 
She's got a lot of baggage. I thought it was you! I should have trusted her. She was right. And what about the charges against her? The charges? I think they're bullshit. Anything else you want to add about Adam Jones? My only regret is that I didn't nail that son of a bitch five years ago. That was gangster. Really? That's the game. All right, I can't listen to too much more of that. Okay, so I believe that's the end of Hidden Agenda. I think it's short enough to where I can play with my friends one more time. I think it actually still be pretty entertaining because although it's short, there's things that I want to see happen differently and there's things that I know my friends will do differently. I don't know how different of a game it'll be, but like if y'all are if y'all want to see it played again, just let me know in the comments with my boys, LJ Joe, uh, my cousin Brandon. But as far as my my opinion on this game, I think it had so much potential. And I don't think that I would believe that it had this much potential. I don't even think that I'd enjoy it as much if I were to just play it in one sitting. I think I'd be like, wow, this was it. But the fact that I took so long to play this, I think that helped make it feel longer. But really, this is a short game that I think is meant to be played with friends real quick. But it's like, it just started getting real good. It just started getting real good. And then it ended. Super Massives, Super Massive Games. Uh, this was this was a great title. Again, I, th I think that y'all did a great thing with this, but it's like, I need more. I need more, I need more. I'm gonna check and see if they're coming out with any other titles in the in the near future, but yo, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Truly appreciate it. Let me know what you think in the comments. Did you enjoy this? Do you think that this was a good game? What would you like to see differently? Um, if you are new, please subscribe for more videos. And as always, I love each and every one of you, and I'll see you in the next, I dropped everything, video. Peace. All right, y'all. Hmm. Hmm. That's what I gotta say about this. Hmm. He wearing that Ash Ketchum hat on. He, he a Pokemon hunter, no badges. <laughs> there, there, hold on, go! Where?